Hi, I'm Dr. Ash Dutta. I'm a cosmetic surgeon. I work with Aesthetic Beauty Center in London, Newcastle and Sunderland. By and large, there are three main types of hair transplant available. The most modern one uh, is the FUE, which is follicular unit extraction, whereby individual follicles are removed with a mechanized punch and then transplanted wherever the need is. The slightly older method is FUT, or the strip method. We take a strip of tissue from the back of the head where the hair lasts the longest and those follicles are then individually removed and then put in place where the patient wants more hair. But there are some patients who do not have any hair at all, like myself, and they are likely to be benefited by biofiber. Biofiber is an artificial hair system. It is a nylon fiber made by Biofiber Company in Italy, and those hairs are transplanted individually uh, with a special needle. Biofiber has been available for over 20 years. It is CE marked. There has been a few complications with older fibers, but the newer fibers, which has started about two or three years ago, we are seeing less and less complications. The main complication we are seeing is swelling, inflammation, and on occasions infection. But if the new regime that we advise the patients to follow with the biofiber, then the complications or the chances of complication are significantly low. The hairs are put in place under local anesthetic. It is virtually the same process as, as if having a normal hair transplant, but on this occasion, the hairs are made of nylon, which is C marked in Europe. Since it is a foreign body, biofiber, once it's inserted, it stays in place for between three to five years. Overall, patients lose about 15% of the biofibers every year and they need to be replaced gradually. But because of the repeated trauma or the process when we put the hairs in, the scalp is of course injured and that can cause tiny bit of swelling, sometimes inflammation and as I said before, infection which can be easily treated with antibiotics. But the patients need to be aware that the biofiber needs to be looked after on a regular basis and the regime that we advise the patients if they follow it regularly and routinely usually these complications are avoided. Patients who do not have much hair left on the head they will benefit from biofiber. However, in the recent months we have seen more and more people requesting body hair transplant that means hairs from the various parts of the body, including the beard, that can be transplanted back onto the scalp. Uh, if the patients do not want to go through those process, then biofiber is the right answer for them. Biofiber has regained its popularity over the last few years. Uh, in the UK, there are only about five doctors performing biofiber on a regular basis. But in the mainland Europe, you'd find there are quite a few doctors doing biofiber, particularly in the uh, Eastern European countries and also in Italy. Mm -hmm.